Ever wondered about the tiny creatures living in your garden? Ventured to peer beneath the leaves and petals to glimpse a world teeming with life, unseen to the naked eye? Well, brace yourselves for a journey into the miniature world of thrips, fascinating insects that dwell in our backyards yet often escape our attention. Imagine a creature so small it's almost invisible, that's a thrip for you. Measuring less than a millimeter, thrips are a group of insects that belong to the order Thysanoptera. With over 6,000 species known to science, these tiny beings inhabit a world that's largely unseen and unexplored. Thrips begin their journey of life as eggs. These minuscule eggs are usually laid by adult females in plant tissues. A remarkable fact about thrips is that many species can reproduce asexually, meaning the females do not need males to produce offspring. This phenomenon, known as parthenogenesis, allows thrips populations to increase rapidly when conditions are favorable. As the days pass, the eggs hatch to reveal larvae, the second stage of the thrips life cycle. These larvae look like miniature versions of the adults but lack wings. They are voracious feeders, using their asymmetrical mouthparts to puncture plant cells and suck out the contents, often causing visible damage to the plants. After feeding and growing for some time, the larvae then enter a non-feeding stage known as the prepupa. This is a time of transformation, a period of change as the thrip prepares for its final metamorphosis. Following the prepupal stage, the thrips enter the pupal stage where they develop wings and other adult characteristics. This entire process from egg to adult can occur in as little as two weeks, depending on the species and environmental conditions. Emerging as adults, thrips take to the air, their tiny wings carrying them to new plants and new territories. They continue to feed, mate, and lay eggs, repeating the cycle of life. It's a fascinating journey, one that unfolds right under our noses, yet often unnoticed. Thrips might be small but their impact on the world around them is significant. They are not just consumers of plant tissues, they also act as pollinators for certain plants. Yet they can be pests too, causing damage to crops and spreading plant diseases. So there we have it, the life of a thrip, a tiny creature with a big story. From egg to adult they navigate a world that's largely unseen, a world teeming with life and activity. They remind us that even in the smallest corners of our gardens life thrives undeterred by size or stature. In the grand tapestry of life every thread counts, and thrips, small as they might be, play their part. They are a testament to the incredible diversity of life on Earth, a reminder that there's always more to discover if we take the time to look. And so, as we conclude our journey into the world of thrips, let's remember not to overlook the small and seemingly insignificant. For in the world of nature, everything has its purpose, its role to play. And thrips, those tiny creatures in our garden, are no exception. They are a part of the intricate web of life, contributing to the rich biodiversity that makes our planet so unique.